Link 2012. Scary skeleton. Now we can move on to a small mines portion. Yeah, the issue with the potion launcher is that it keeps activating on my bat. Or my torch placer, whatever you want to call them. Spiders are just disgustful. It's part of the five. And strength too. Oh boy. Never have I feared spiders so much in my life. These guys are crazy. Oh boy. Wait, do they do fire? They actually set you on fire. I forgot that it was possible. I think I took inspiration from Vex for that. Yes, I definitely took inspiration from Vex for that. The fire spiders were terrifying. I'm guessing that these guys have regen based on the fact that they are having a hard time getting killed. here. These guys are tricky, especially since I'm so slow, man. No depth strider. Oof. I'll drop coins. And these guys also drop a potion, which is... Enhanced speed potion. Oh yes, that's the big difference. So the thing with the enhanced speed potion is they normally give you slowness, but we already have a ton of slowness. So it has no effect on us. So it's just pure speed too. Press. Yeah, you guys definitely have regen. These guys just won't stop coming. There's so many of them. Ugh. No, she's coming after me. Guys, just forget about it. Alright, we're going over this way. Oh, is there a head there that I forgot? Perhaps. Now over here is the creepers, the creeper spawners. These guys are just as scary. Okay, I remember creepers now. So you might normally think, hey, fire aspect, good idea, right? No, these guys will explode if you put fire aspect on them. That is their thing, That that's what they do. They, they explode if you light them on fire. And I decided to put lava all around this area just to show you how awful that could end up being. So we may end up oh, or retiring our lucid dream because of that. No, this is not a good position to be in. I want to take down that spawner. Spiders are going to give me a hard time though. Thankfully we have lots of blast resistance. Or, well, we don't have a lot. It's just that we have... Spider, get out of here. And since both of our both our bow and our sword have fire aspect right now, it's not a good combo. But who's to know? Who who is to know that it would be a bad thing to have fire aspect? Now of course, this isn't the end of the world. It's just none of the, the end of the It's just annoying for when there's chests around, because you don't want the chests to be permanently destroyed. Good. 
one of their spawners is down. There's one more over there. I'm not sure if I'm gonna try to go deal with it. Yeah, these guys just don't want to die. We're gonna need to go get some better weaponry, really. We've got Flame 1, Fire Aspect 2. So it's kind of interesting to have these creepers that explode like they do. You might want to have them explode, actually. Oh, snap. We're a ways away from where I want to be. We're a long ways away from where I want to be right now, really. We could rush it. We could rush to where I want to be. Perhaps. Perhaps. Oh, come on. Why am I not moving? I don't want to rush through this area too badly, though. Too, too much. At the same time, I really want to get to this one place. put away our valuables, first of all. Coins. Let's go put away the coins, too. I don't know how many coins I need for everything. Remember. But we're going to try to rush. We're going to try to rush through here. Uh, for several reasons. First of all, we can light it up a little bit. Secondly, I want to get somewhere in particular. We should have a panic potion on us, so we're okay. Where's the way up? Where's the way up? The way up. I guess this is a way up. We're alive. We're alive. Yes, this is where I want to go. I'm go right here. And we're safe. Okay, we're good. All right, this is not. <laughs> Oh no, am I the wrong place? Oh no, I think I might have gone the wrong way. No boy, okay. We gotta keep rushing. Gotta keep on rushing. Okay, we didn't see it, sadly, but normally when you look out that door, a huge Herobrine head uh, pops out of nowhere. Oh man, I'm sad I didn't get to see that gag because I'm trying to rush through this right now. I get here and then close the door. Okay, we're good. We're safe. We are safe. Woof. Woof, man. Particles on. Let's go ahead and turn the particles on. There's just all sorts of love particles. So Hall of Love. Oh, and we probably aren't gonna. You know what? Since there's few pl few players here, we might actually grab it in the end. And I forget about all these awesome people. All right. Welcome to the Hall of Love. Here you will find all the amazing people who helped make this project a success. Feel like you deserve your head in the Hall of Love? If, if so, you're in luck. Simply follow the instructions on the next page. Sign up at the Hyper High Pixel Forums. Open this thread in your browser. Follow the instructions on your Hall of Love. This was an interesting thing for a while. Unfortunately, as you can see, it's pretty much empty. There's a few jokes here and there. I mean, like here you have Squeak, <laughs> Arth, you have Steve. These these were actually some jokes that were originally in the map too. You have Grupo's loves lo, Grupo loves Steve's head. And over here, this is what I wanted to come to. This is the thing I wanted to go to ASAP because I can't remember it all. The black market. Hey kid, want some items? If you grind some coins for us, we can get you all kinds of goodies. And he's Rev Capone. How? We used to work exploring good memories. Things have changed, though. We need something else to hold us over. I'm the ringleader here. Oh, yeah, so you they, they each have their own little sayings. And so we can get 
10 coins, 100 coins, 1,000 coins, or you can also exchange them back. Right, and so here we have the dark nose. <laughs> I am good at stealing things. <laughs> oh man, yeah, there's so many funny things here. Okay, and so you can get stretch dynamite, press Q to throw, causes a mob damaging blast shortly after. So this doesn't hurt you, it hurts everything else. Um, then we have likes. Cause a terrain damaging blast shortly after. So there's different types of dynamite here. Then there's likes, which you know what likes do. And then there's sleeping stones, frame fragments. This costs you 30 coins. Those are actually sort of expensive. Sorted skulls, 30 coins. Quantum furnace, 30 coins. That's actually really cheap. I'm surprised. Sulfur tips, five coins. These are actually pretty cheap. I'd rather get sulfur tips here than at the other place. Ha! Nope. No more trades. Can we trade XP bottles for coins? Uh, maybe. We'll see. Justin Villager! Alright, he says, I'm the distraction! <laughs> oh, that's great. I love this. I love this. You get cola nuts if you give them 17. Award for every three le for three you look collect, you get some levels. You can trade a coin for a bottle of enchanting. You trade 50 coins for a snazzy for some snazzy particle commands. Oh, snap! Oh, and you can get Disco Pants! Oh, I love Disco Pants! We need to get all of these in the end, guys. We're going to be doing a lot of coin grinding. 99 coins for 100 coins. <laughs> oh, I love this! Okay, so you can technically profit coins, but it's just going to take you forever. No more trades. Okay. Alright, this is Chuck Villager. Zombies can't kill me. I turn zombies into villagers. <laughs> yeah, so you know, it's like Chuck Norris. Um, you know, Chuck Norris jokes. Okay, 100 coins for a rune set. Ooh, that's pretty cool. 1,500 coins for unbreakable legendary set. I like that. Uh, 250 coins for an unbreakable rune set. So apparently... A rune set is classified as more valuable than a legendary set. Okay, fair enough. Rune attributes reveal. Oh, cool. 200 coins to see the rune attributes. And then you can trade 250 coins to get a hybrid set. So it's a CTM set plus a legendary set. So we can also get legendary rune. Holy smokes, for 600 coins. Ooh, that would actually be really, really overpowered. Is there unbreakable? Descent plus rune. Oh, snap. A thousand coins. And this is a power set. Ooh, interesting. Oh, man. There's so many cool items here. I want everything. We're, oh, guys, we're going to have to farm so many coins for this. This is going to be so fun once we get all the coins here. All right. We have Mad Carson. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. He says, I am the happy evil scientist and I like potions. <laughs> I love him. <laughs> okay, so we have a stamina potion for 100 coins? Really? No way, man. That's an awful trade. 45 coins for Discord. Instant health, 6. So the reason that this might be good is for the final boss fight, because this will just wreck him. It'll also wreck mobs and heal you. You can also get enhanced speed potion for 50 coins. Really, really not worth it, because we have some of those. We have Enhanced Speed Potion Amplified. Okay, yeah, that's normal. We can get a bottle of Feud. This will give weakness forever, wither. Yes, this is actually really good for the final boss fight, too. Because you just throw this on him, and he will be weak forever. Like, he, will have, he will deal five hearts less damage to you. Now, I think that's a pretty big deal. All right, then we have holy water, which, as we know, we really don't need. We have plenty of that. We can get an extended cheesy potion. We get the immobility potions. That's actually really expensive. It's weird. It only lasts 10 seconds. Flask of Disparge. That's it for Carson. And then we have the Outcast. I think the Outcast has some of the coolest stuff. I don't want to talk about it. 
Actually, can I see his face? Oh yeah, he just says I don't want to talk about it. Ten coins. Critical thought. This rare charm allows you to look back at the past in order to gain experience. It also causes you to analyze the lives of the deceased, giving plus seven XP on all kills. 170 coins. Best trade ever. Um, then we have shortcomings for 200 coins. Or shortcomings, for some reason. Then we have squandered success, which is power 32, punch 1, for 240 coins. Then we have origins, question mark, ooh, protection, and that's just an error block. But it has protection, VI, feather falling 2, fire protection, black protection, predicted not protection, red protection, popcorn, finny, thorns, death rider. Basically, a way, 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 way better version of, um, what is it? What's his name? Um, the original Strafer's head. But at the at the expense of not being able to wear a set. And then we'll have a Maculotaucin laced scythe. Which is smite 4, smite 3, smite 7, smite 12. Hmm, interesting numbers there. Uh, and it's 16 attack damage. This thing is able to one-hit kill mobs, by the way. It's, it's 3,000 coins. We're never going to get it. Although it would be cool. Right. I really want some of this stuff, man. Like the dark... Like this stuff, okay. We're gonna, probably going to get plenty of dynamite here. Likes, we really don't need sleeping stones. But... Some of these guys... Like, I don't, I remember the disco pants are so cool. We need to get those. Also, snazzy particle commands kit. That sounds like it's fun. This guy's just fun. Justin Villager. Chuck Villager has all the cool sets. Uh, Mad Carson. I don't think we're going to get anything from Mad Carson, really. Except for maybe that one potion that weakens them forever. Critical Thought is probably one of the first things we want to get. Because in order to get Cupid, we really need Critical Thought. And then I don't know what shortcomings are. Squandered success. And I forget what all these are, to be honest with you. I forget what half these sets are. <laughs> so, oh boy, man. So this is why I came here. I, want, I wanted to come here just to see all this. Okay, we're good for now, though. That was great. Oh, man. And they all, they all go back down. So, yeah, you can't see them anymore. Okay, then. So we come back down here. This is actually... This actually leads us back out. To where I was trying to go, but I forgot how to get there. Yeah, so we can... Shimmy on back. Alright, let's go. I don't want to die. I really want more speed, to be honest with you. This is not very easy to tolerate. Actually, we can rush through here to see if we missed anything. Boom. Nice. Looks like there's a mine shaft right... Oh, no. A cauldron right there. Oh, wait. It has something in it. What did it have in it? Oh, it has ores in it. Let's go pick it up. Ah, uh, really not worth that much. Okay. It's time to go prepare for this. Oh boy, I want coin farming though. Oh, you know what would be great for coin farming? These things. So if we ever find two of these that are close together, we need to snag it and use it. Do we have hunger here? We don't. Okay, that's good. I was hoping we wouldn't. Right, we're gonna light up this path a bit more. Don't see anything here. Let's actually go up. I'm just curious if there's anything up here. No, it doesn't look like it.
There we go. We're going back. It's really not worth it. All right, so we're on the final area. The one that's not supposed to be fun, it's supposed to be philosophical. Oh boy. It's gonna be crazy. I don't know if I want to keep this set or not. I really like the idea of a descent plus rune set. A rune plus legendary set. Issues we don't have a coin farm yet. Go ahead and put a lot of this away. I actually might take a break, to be honest with you. It's early in the morning. And I'd like to relax a little bit before tackling this final area. This is going to be tough. This is going to be a really tough area. But we don't need that. Um, we have a few coins already, though, which is nice. And we haven't even gone into the main area. Yeah, it looks like we're getting one coin a kill. So really, that 3,000 coins thing is 3,000 kills. It wouldn't be about... You know what actually I'm going to do? I'm going to go AFK at the XP creator. That way we can get a Cupid. And uh, I think that's about it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to call it a quits, and then I'll come back to you guys. We'll have lots of this. We'll pro I'll probably have to go with AFK again today because, I, like I said, I did. I do want. Um. What is it? I want the. I want all those coins. So I guess if we don't get them all going through the area, we can make some stuff happen. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. Make the most of your day, and don't forget to contribute.